हमारे जो हमारे कल्चर में जो तपस्या की बात करते हैं इट ओपन द माइंड एक्चुअली इफ यू आर इफ यू आर सिटिंग एंड यू आर इन पेन यू नो यू सी यू सी ऑल आर एंशंट ऋषिज एंड ऑल सिटिंग देयर यू सी इमेजेस ऑफ द बुद्धा यू सी इमेजेस ऑफ गुरु नानक सिटिंग देर इज अ रीजन बिकॉज they are purposely putting themselves through stress they are putting themselves through pain they are putting themselves through disturbance and when you do that it opens your mind it allows you to see things that you never see before you walk i walk couple thousand kilometers i'm telling you after you know on day 3 or day 4 i was saying bhai ek matlab kya kar diya maine Seriously, because I was like, how how is this going to happen? How am I going to actually walk four thousand kilometers? And then slowly, slowly, it unfolds. It happens, right? So I mean, you're you're from different uh, spaces of work. You're from different, you know, your your business people, your people who work in the NGO field. That's how you should think about it. Take just take a challenge that you think you can never do. and put yourself under stress and then you'll suddenly find that you will yourself start pulling out avenues that you'd never imagined ye ho sakta hai and so for me it's a learning experience of course it's a political experience but it was much more a personal uh, experience for me like uh, my people wanted a political element to it and i i was like i'm not interested in a political because for me this is much more about it's like a labor of love it's not politics it's my country has given me so much has given me so much affection they it's like repaying a debt for me so there are two things right the first thing is that the opposition is thinking about this election in a fundamentally different way than it thought about any other election before this one which is that the opposition is united in the idea that india is now under attack the concept of india the concept of free elections the concept of free speech they are now under mortal threat as far as the bjp is concerned so this is this is something that is unanimous which means that our behavior has to change which means that our flexibility has to increase which means that we have to realize that we are now fighting for the soul of india which requires a different level of cooperation so that's the first the first point the second point is actually if you look at the alliances the bulk of them are pretty much stitched up there are a couple question marks but the bulk of them are stitched up right uh kerala bihar madhya pradesh the big places there's no issue in some of the smaller places there's an issue we will try to iron out those issues right but the broader way we are dealing with each other is that we are seeing each other now as defending the idea of india earlier we were thinking that look this is a fight between a political party and another political party now we are saying no 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 now the rss and the bjp are trying to destroy the idea of india free speech participation of everybody you know uh the destruction of anybody any business person who stands against these monopolists these are anti india ideas hamare jo hamare culture mein jo tapasya ki baat karte hain it opens the mind actually if you are if you are sitting and you are in pain you know you see you see all our ancient uh rishis and all sitting there or you see images of uh, the buddha or you see images of guru nanak sitting there there's a reason because 
they are purposely putting themselves through stress they are putting themselves through pain they are putting themselves through disturbance and when you do that it opens your mind it allows you to see things that you never see before you walk i walk couple thousand kilometers i'm telling you after you know on day 3 or day 4 i was saying bhai matlab kya kar diya maine seriously because i was like how how is this going to happen how am i going to actually walk 4000 kilometers and then slowly slowly it unfolds it happens right so i mean you are you are from different uh, spaces of work you're from different you know your your business people your people who work in the ngo field that's how you should think about it take just take a challenge that you think you can never do and put yourself under stress and then you'll suddenly find that you will yourself start pulling out avenues that you'd never imagined ye ho sakta hai and so for me it's a learning experience of course it's a political experience but it was much more a personal uh, experience for me like uh, my people wanted a political element to it and i i was like i'm not interested in a political element because for me this is much more about it's like a labor of love it's not politics it's my country has given me so much has given me so much affection they it's like repaying a debt for me namaskar main hu ahmed agar aap koi video pasand aaya तो लाइक करें शेयर करें और हाँ सब्सक्राइब करना ना भूलें धन्यवाद